Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa Ellen Arianis, TEA, and this is Tea Time Adventures on YouTube. And today it's Medical Adventures with Teresa. Oh yes. This is Creamy Vanilla Smoothie Ready Cat, a barium sulfate oral suspension, because in about an hour I have to go get a urgent CT scan. CT scan. Um, I've been having issues <laughs> since May. I was pretty much blaming it on the birria <laughs> I ate, just going through me and killing all the little flora in my intestines, but apparently that's not it. I've had lab work done, and that hasn't shown anything other than I really need to take my medications and take better care of myself and eat better. Um, but I've also had an ultrasound, and that said my right kidney is fine, my gallbladder is fine, and while I do have a slightly enlarged liver, it's not that much difference from last year's test. So it, it isn't a major concern with my doctor. However, the pains that I've been having in my stomach have increased. In this past three-day holiday weekend, I pretty much spent it between being in bed, on the couch, lowing like a cow, and the bathroom. Yesterday when I went to work, which was Tuesday, I had my usual breakfast that I have Monday through Fridays, which is a Jimmy Dean's Delight low-cal, low-fat sandwich, um, breakfast sandwich, and a uh, Kroger's um, Carb Master yogurt, which is low-cal, low-fat, low-everything, <laughs> which is only like 60 or 70 calories, and I think the sandwich is like 250. But within an hour, I was doubled over in pain. It was the worst I have had so far. And I ended up in the bathroom crying, sweating, and doing other heinous things. And I had to come home. I told my boss, this is getting bad. I um, messaged my doctor on uh, what's called my chart. And she put in for an urgent CT scan. Our radiology department got me in today at 11 o'clock. Now the fun part about a CT scan with contrast is that you have to drink barium. One of these was consumed last night before I went to bed and it's about an hour before I have to take off for my test. So I'm gonna drink this right now. I did ask for berry. They sent me vanilla. I'm not a big fan of vanilla. Let's hope I can get the top off without too much work. Um, Safety sealed. Oh, this stuff is almost so hard. I don't know how folks with arthritis. Yeah, when in doubt, use your teeth. Um, it is a very milky, chalky substance, for lack of a better term. It's still smooth because it's a smoothie, but I got to drink it, and I got to drink it now. So, bottom is up. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm not going to say it's refreshing. I'm not going to say it tastes good. But for those of you that have never had a CT scan with contrast, it this is the easiest part of it. At least it's not a colonoscopy. Mm. Yuck. It could be worse. It really could. It's kind of like drinking liquid clay or liquid chalk. If I tinted it blue, I could almost pretend it's the milk from Star Wars, A New Hope, but it's not. Ugh. And I can't say it's vile tasting. It's more of a mouth feel. It's just, it is what it is. The faster I get it down, the better it'll be. This provides a contrast of my entire GI uh, tract from the top of the stomach to the exit. Um, and it'll help the imaging system, the CT scanner, um, figure out what's going on from my stomach. It'll highlight anything, twists, turns, turns, bulges, scarring, polyps, tumors, whatever it is that's going on in my stomach and my intestines, this is going to help pinpoint it and hopefully we can figure out what's going on and take care of it. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this off for now. Um, 
Ugh. Wish me luck. I'm sure I'll get back to you. Maybe not in this video, but those of you that uh, chit chat with me privately, you'll probably know before this video even goes up. So wish me well, everyone. I'm really looking forward to a diagnosis so I know what's going on and the pain and uncomfortableness that I've been uh, dealing with since May uh, can be dealt with, cured, handled, whatever it is. So Thank you so much for joining me on my barium sulfate CT scan journey for the day, the medical adventure that I'll be going on. <laughs> so take good care of yourselves. No, seriously, take good care of yourselves. Do what I say, not what I do. And take care of each other. Love you guys. Bye. Back with a bit of an addendum. Well, that was easy. Um, it actually took me longer to get situated um, laying down in the machine since I can't breathe when I'm laying flat, so they had to prop me up a little bit. Um, but um, the first time that oops, they tried to catch a vein, it blew out. Um, <laughs> and then they couldn't find it on either elbow because of uh, scar tissue. Um, and then they found it in my arm. So um, not only did I have to drink the barium, but there was also an iodine uh, injection as well. So that was the two part of the contrast. So other than having my arms over my head for just a couple of minutes and being told to breathe and hold my breath for a little bit and let it in and out, um, everything was fine. It went easy. Um, I don't know how long it'll take to get the results back, but um, <laughs> I made them give me a pink bandage <laughs> to match my outfit. So that was it. Fingers crossed for good results and quick results. Um, I do have to abstain from taking uh, my metformin, which is one of my diabetic medications. Can't take that until like Friday evening or Saturday morning because of interactions with the contrast. And I have to drink at least three bottles of water. Um, once I get home, they've given me one for free. Um, so yeah, that's, that's all there is to it. Um, again, this is an addendum to, even though I've already said goodbye. <laughs> So I talk to you all later. Thanks for coming along on my little medical adventure. Bye.